we're off to a good start today we're spectating fortune's keep and again the, the premise of this is to to see what players are doing right i've been playing all damn day so my ass my ass vm should be completely fine i think a lot of players a lot of the sweats are waiting for rebirth so they can get their 40 50 kills and feel good about themselves but i think i think most people on these maps aren't going to be there and what we just witnessed it's kind of going hand in hand what i'm thinking Moving on to Edward, rocking one kill, if you really want to call it that. More of a participation trophy after killing that AI. Now, okay, well, to be fair, the guy was on mini-map when we started shooting. I don't know if he was on mini-map before. The fact that he already ADS had him pretty fired, I'll have to go back in the edit and look. I'm not accusing him, but I'm just saying, keep your eye on shit like that. I know we watched the dude run in here, but of all of that, out of him running away, already being up the ladder, we decided to look that direction. Here we are, prone crawl to greatness. Now nah, he ain't cheating. Ain't no way. And anyway, I say it all the time, I'm gonna say it, I'm gonna say it again. And it's not gonna be the last time. If they remove the underground systems from this map, this map would be infinitely better. I like it. Yeah, moving on. This map would be infinitely better. Mainly one for, sh for shit like this, but two, like, bring some action to the surface. So many people come down here to hide, sit in rooms, crouch walk. Look at this. This is this is the lobby. C4. Molotov. There's a guy pushing us, by the way, but he needed all 100 bullets. All of them. Every fucking one of them to get a kill. <laughs> that... That's savage, bro. That's what that is. That's that's he's a wild boy for that one. That's crazy. That's crazy. I don't know what the enemy threw at us. I don't know. I look at a C4, but clearly it wasn't, or the dude just forgot how to pull the trigger. But yeah, dude, I really think if they just brought all this map to the surface, this map would be infinitely better. Granted, the tunnel system is why the numbers survive as long as they do, but regardless, man, it's all about having fun. It's all about getting into action. And that's the great thing about resurgence, the fact that it always feels Kind of like that TDM energy, not this shit. I mean, now, now let me ask you, would you rather die to a sweat or die to this guy? What? What would, what would you rather? Die to a sweat or die to this guy? Ooh, ooh, hands of death. Also, the fact they added a ray gun in this game is just absurd, absurd. Remember, remember, a guy who took 100 rounds to get one kill now has a two-hit kill ray gun. Yeah, that seems fair. <laughs> that seems abundantly fair. And here we are. Why? Why the? F why would we do that? Apparently, there's method to his madness. The moment it hit, he was like, fuck it, time to go. Yeah, I'm about to say, ain't no way you're about to pick up a bounty and go hunting. And thank God. Granted, he's already got a scab, so he can't do a bounty, but we know damn well he was not meaning to pick that up. There's no way. Look at this, bro. Like, dude, what? And the reason why I asked who would you rather get killed by is, again, there should not be ways for people to play like this. There really shouldn't. Warzone 1 is very rare. Very few spots. I think Warzone 1, the only place people would play like this was prison. Um, and like downtown rooftops, but <laughs> it wasn't really that hard to kill people doing this. Areas like this, the dark corners, he's wearing the dark skin. I mean, he's preloading a shock charge with a two hit kill ray gun. You know, it'd be kind of dope. Think about it. I think this map in a zombie mode would be round base zombies, by the way, not the stupid DMZ shit's ass. I think this map would be fire. Not. Think about the trains you could run through here. I, I'm surprised they don't do shit like that. But then again, it is Activision. Also, X Defiant should already be out by the time this video posts. What do you guys think about it? I haven't played it yet because it's only Monday and it comes out tomorrow. But it does look good. Watching that game evolve since the very first alpha has honestly, and again, I haven't played it yet. It's been inspiring watching a game company that actually cares. And if you watch the interview with Mark Rubin, um, the former Activision lead through the great CODs, Modern Warfare 1, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3, um, he had a lot to say about SVMM. We can break a video down on the channel if you want. Let me know if you want me to do that. He keeps trying to reload this. I don't, I don't know if he's getting the hit or not. I mean, dude... 
he's flushed money down the toilet for these skins. I mean, it's your prerogative, dude. Do what you want, your money, but he paid real life money to play like this. And if anyone was wondering where I was going with that anxiety comment, this is it. Right, this is just anxiety. This is just the, the completely being afraid in a video game. And look at that aim, bro. Look at that. The micro adjustments are all over the place. And every time we see him sit still, he always sits in the dark shadows. Yeah, keep YYing, brother. You got it. This is the most invigorating gameplay I've ever witnessed in my entire life. It's going to be a great day when we watch this dude die. It's going to be absolutely amazing. People, when they're getting spectated, get a lot of pressure on them. They start doing weird shit, hoping you'll like, you'll leave. Nah, I'm in here for a long haul, bro. You can teabag the wall to death. I don't give a shit. I'm here to watch this greatness take place, man. Let's see how good this gameplay will get you. I bet money he doesn't win. I bet he doesn't last the top five. That's a, that's a hard bet. That's a hard bet. Top five is not hard in this game. He's buying UAVs though. There might be hope for him after all. No way. Oh, he's just trying to refill his prox mines. Okay. That makes sense. I thought he was trying to refill the ray gun the whole time, to be honest. My bad. And here we are. Back to it. Let's go, baby. Look, there's one thing to say about hands of death. He's, he's consistent. He's wasted more streaks. I okay. All right, we're gonna we're gonna rotate. We're finally seeing the light of day for the first time. This is a magical moment for us. He needs to play it up. Oh yeah, there you, that was fucking smooth. I like that. Nice. You know you can actually cancel throwing shit like that. You can cancel it. It's it's, it's dope. Ten bullets left, bro. He's gonna be in a world of shit when he runs out of ammo in this gun. He's gonna be a world of shit. So is his internet. Look at this lag. Damn. Well, I thought he was gonna pre-rotate. That's why he rotated early, but he just came here to camp for two seconds and then switch perk packages. Switch. Uh, no, we're gonna keep the LMG and granted. You know what? I respect that he needs all hundred fucking bullets. Guy on the rooftop. I don't know if he saw him or not. Uh, still blind as absolute dog shit. Wow. I'm surprised he even had the precision to get a kill with this gun, to be honest. He got a few of those, at, I wouldn't say range, but he got them far away. I'm surprised he hit a shot. Wait, what? Oh, he dropped the LMG. Oh. Oh. Oh, getting a little confident. We got, okay, we got the guy on the left side, of course, on top of the... We've, we've got the guy over here. We've got gunfire over here as well. There's nine enemies left besides those two guys we just identified. So there's a lot of people. We have no idea where the hell they are. I was leading up to say we need to try our best to get to the high ground to stay up. I don't want to be in here. This is going to be one of the most active buildings in this area. Don't waste your... Yeah, I'm about to say don't. This is going to be one of the most active areas. The problem with being here is I like the aggression. I like the fighting. The problem is when he rotates away, all these buildings are already looking here. So assuming he survives the guys that are over here, which there is a guy to our left. I think he's going to get killed as he rotates. Let's see. I give him too much credit, bro. I thought he was going to like rotate. He's just going to play the edge. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Why, why are we still looting? Oh. Oh, he's mad. Oh, he's so mad. And I don't blame him. I don't blame him. This dude's... Yeah. Dude, I'd be pissed. We got the guy. Oh. We saw my mini map behind us. We need to be careful of the rooftop again, and the guys behind us. I don't like. I don't like the, our position at all. We're not looking any direction where the enemies could be coming from. We're looking at a dead body. Fucking karma. That's what you get. L M A O. That is what you get, brother. That is what you get. You sat in all those corners that whole time, and karma bit you in the ass. Good. Good shit, Lord Vader. Respect. Moving on to the next camp and baby back, bitch. Enemies on the right. Enemy to the left. To right. A little delayed on that. I don't know if he had a headset on or not. I definitely do. <laughs> moving on to OG Greek. All right, moving on to Storm. These guys are falling out so fast. PDS going out, out, in, wait, in the zone. Okay, that is stupid. Bro, why? You Storm, you better kill this shitter. You better absolutely annihilate this fucking bot, dude. Why would you waste the PDS if you're not even in gas? Okay, I don't know about Storm, dude. He needs to shoot. This guy's in the open pushing across. Yeah, that was an easy kill. I don't know why we didn't do it sooner, but 
Your, your boy's absolutely living on edge. Throwing a PDS in the zone. Like, not, not in the gas. Like, inside the safe area. Because all it did was tell him where he was at. Storm instantly knew your boy's over there. I'm surprised he didn't kill him sooner, but...